Namaste everyone. My name is Billy and I am making a series of videos answering questions about awakening, spiritual awakening, uh, self-realization, enlightenment, and the seven levels of human perception, which uh, come from a vision that I had a couple of months ago. I do not come to these discussions as some sort of scholar. I do not have a college degree. I do not come as an intellectual trying to create some new way of thinking. I do not come as a psychologist because what I speak about is beyond the mind although I may use psychological terms at some point in time. I do not come as a humanitarian trying to save the world. Uh, whatever I speak, if it's something that is useful to you, use it. If it's not, discard it and find what is useful uh, for you. In fact, I come with no identity. I, I do not come as this or that. Uh, I just come as I am. I speak of my own experiences. Uh, sometimes I correlate those with the experiences of others. And I speak purely out of simplicity. Um, I speak to your soul. I do not speak to the mind, although at times I, it is a must to bridge the, the mental patterns that humans have in order to go beyond the mental patterns. So in this next series of videos, uh, in partnership uh, with my dear friend Genevieve, we are going to be um, tackling um, what's what we call life's biggest questions and we might even tackle some questions about uh, psychology or sociology you, you know uh, human perception culture uh, all these questions are relevant um, to uh, suffering. They're all relevant to desire and fear, which if there's anything to move beyond, it is those things. In order to see that you are perfect as you are, that your happiness is always within you, it is never on the outside of you, and that your ultimate awakening does not depend upon any specific religion or spirituality or yoga or anything like that. So as you watch through these videos, if you have further questions, please ask these questions so we can uh, dive deeper into um, the essence of what is being spoken about here. Uh, ultimately, uh, this, this movement of consciousness, when traced back to its source, you see that what exists cannot truly be spoken about. The absolute, the supreme reality cannot be spoken about. But we can certainly uh, move as close as we can with words uh, to this space, especially uh, to develop some sort of understanding. Uh, so um, you can take up a couple of simple practices to move out of the body, out of the mind, and into pure awareness where 
you will find uh, your greatest happiness if if that's a if that's a word we can use in this video and your greatest peace and no matter what your problem is now no matter what you're suffering from now all suffering all desire all fear it dissolves into this space and you can find yourself in that space and even go deeper than that. Also, I would like to say that I speak very openly and very raw about my own existence, my experiences, and uh, I'm not here to sugarcoat anything or to create some sort of new way of thinking or some, uh, you know, movement of some kind. In fact, all of those things will just simply get in the way of your ultimate uh, awakening, your happiness. So even see beyond the words that I speak and take what feels right to you and utilize it. What does not feel right to you, just put it up upon a shelf or discard it. Maybe at some point in time you come back and it makes sense to you. And maybe it never makes sense to you and it doesn't have to make sense. Uh, again, you can always discard what does not feel right to you. Make this as simple as possible. Um, there's no need to make any of this into some complex uh, theory or philosophy. So uh, much love. Namaste.